Hello, everybody. Finally time after many delays. First, I delayed in getting the initial video up just to introduce the giveaway. Then I delayed in the actual giveaway. But we're here now, so you had two or three days to respond to the prompt to win one of the stacks of cards here. And let's take a look. Like I said, usually I do a time check because we stick to that 24-hour window. Don't need to do that now because you've had Hello. quite a bit. So let's just take a look at some of the comments. Uh, to enter, I asked you to respond to the prompt, uh, suggest a Halloween costume for yours truly. There's 37 responses. We'll go through them sort of fast, but I would like to read these. So, Steely Mike says, dress up as a favorite Mariners player or jersey you already have. It's always great to teach kids about local heroes and athletes. I don't disagree, except one of my two jerseys is Robinson Cano. I don't know that I want to teach them about him. I do have a Mitch Hanniger jersey, which is uh, like a knockoff it's a China jersey. It's two sizes too small, but I am going to wear it tomorrow for Spirit Day uh, just to help kind of rally the team, show my support. I'm just going to wear it like a, like it's a jacket or or a zip up or whatever. Um, junior Baseball Fanatic. Nice TTM. Good luck, everyone. A Ghostbuster or dress up like an envelope for TTM return. That's great. Diamond Princess says Wonder Woman. Uh, ye, that's not something you would want to see me dressed up as Wonder Woman. I promise you that much. Shaw Racing, uh, you like the meat stack the best. I think you should do a Kiss member. Maybe, just as long as it's not Peter Chris, I would, I would do consider that. Autograph 2000, I would like to see you dressed up as Joe Exotic or Dog the Bounty Hunter. <laughs> I would, uh, you all like the meat stack as well. Ethan Hathaway, Kraken player, yeah. Uh, watched two of the three pregame games so far, and they happen to be both of the ones that they won, which is cool. Uh, it's a crazy time of year because uh, if you're following baseball, you know, like, essentially the Mariners are in a wild card hunt, and then we have this, you know, this hockey thing starting here in Seattle, so... I got, that's one reason why this video took so long just to get up, because I've been trying to figure out how to budget my time. Augie, based off a famous athlete, or just go as a ball player. Brandon has a couple suggestions. Uh, Run DMC, I love Run DMC. Someone else said, it. Go, that's two Ghostbusters. Karate Kid, Mike Schmidt, just as a baseball card. Jason VT Sports Guy, Harry Potter. Boy, that mead stack. Now, I don't ask people to declare what stack they want when they make their initial comment. Uh, I don't mind that you do, but wow, that's a popular stack. Rick Sports Cards, dress up as the knuckleball poster in the background. Okay. Uh... Not sure how I'd pull that off, but sure would be interesting, wouldn't it? Uh, 25 Perez. Oh, dress up as an NYY player. A scare the Mariners fan. Yeah, if we do end up playing them in the wild card game, I, I'm not sure how excited. I mean, I'm not sure how confident I would be about that. But just the idea that it, we're in a position where that's possible is is exciting right now. Um, Wilbur, dress up as Mac tonight. You'll take any stack. Tony Black said, if you're, oh, she goes, Jay Buhner. I have way more hair than him. 63s and 64s are super nice. Great autos this month. Halloween, you should go as Scott from Ranger Studios or Mario from Mario Brothers. That's great. Uh, Megan TT Hobbies, Seattle Pilots player. I wonder who I would pick. I never really thought about that. Red Rum. Thought he missed the deadline, but again, the deadline just guarantees your entry. If it takes me longer to get the video up, 
then you're good. So you're good. Uh, Grandpa Munster. I'm getting pretty close to Grandpa age here. Uh, Ken, a Keith Shore Griffey. Oh my. Uh, I'm not going to go there. I would need to airbrush out all my... I don't know. I don't even know how I would do that. Uh, Chris Crafts 101. Uh, dress up as a blaster box. Alan Twitchell. Mid-70s meatloaf. That might be like the most doable one of all these. Because I have kind of long hair right now. And uh, I got, you know, physique-wise, I wouldn't. that wouldn't be much of a reach. So, uh, Alan, I really like that. <laughs> I don't know how many people would know who he is. Especially my kids, they they would have no chance. My uh, my third graders, Carolina hits cards, um, random American Pharaoh or race the racehorse, a Pharaoh outfit with an American flag painted on a horse head, <laughs> Math Bowler, uh, Steve from Blues Clues, that's great, uh, card closet. Um, Mandalorian, poor man stack, um, hot goes a hot dog because my son said he wanted to be a hot dog when he grew up. That's great. What are the comments here? Um, oh, uh, you asked about, you commented about, um, me doing the 64 and do I work on any uh, 70s? Yeah, I'm doing 73, which is also a combo auto and non autoed set and I have quite a bit of it. I'm still putting together a checklist for that. So, but that will actually go up pretty soon. Cool plastics. You can wear straw hat, shades, fluorescent vest and goes boy toy Roy or wear a yellow shirt with a black chevron paint, carry a football and go as Charlie Brown. Uh, you know, I could never be as cool as boy toy Roy, so I wouldn't even try it. Johnny Serena, uh, Giant Mask. Scott says uh, I should dress up as a blue tape. He should dress up as green tape. Uh, and then we, we duke it out with the proceeds going to charity. Uh, I love it. Oh, Henry S. says we need to get red tape involved. All right. The Battle of the Tapes. Michael Myers, Cliff Claven from Cheers. He knows I'm a Cheersaholic. Henry S., I guess it would be, uh, go as Indiana Jones with a fake snake or idol. You throw me the retail, I throw you the whip. Sort of Indiana Jones as Comic-Con with a thrifted jacket, leather bag, and old fedora. Or was I normally dressed that way? I love the, uh, I got reading this and then I started coming up with all these scenarios of uh, how you could incorporate, like, baseball cards into movies and i even imagine that big ball like uh uh the, the big round rock that's chasing indy had having like a fanatics logo on it wouldn't that be hilarious okay we could get carried we could do that all day uh a whims dress up as dr fauci not going there uh also not going kim coy no comment on president biden we don't do politics here. I mean, you can you can try, but I'm not going to bite. Copy the link. Here we go. Paste the... It always throws me that they have this, this sample text in there because it looks like you've, you've already pasted it. Uh, there really were no du duplicate users. Get user comments. Okay. Um, this is the point where you need to start paying attention if you didn't do that first part, because I'm going to go over what you're going to pick the stacks. So we'll just call this Depoto stack in honor of the, uh, Mariners, uh, playoff hunt. And I'm getting my best, those back pages, air quotes here. Depoto stack. You got a Depoto. Chris Chandler and Bill Moss. And I usually send four cards, so I might throw in something from your favorite team. Ruben Mays. 
the great Saint and Coog. Archie Sin Fraco, and you, it is it is pronounced Archie, not Archie. Fred Marion. So that's the maze stack. This is the one everyone's after. Meads. Holy smokes. I do I do really like this photo. That's why I put it on front. I just thought that was a great. Uh, just the colors are working nicely, and it's really nicely signed. So I can't say I don't understand. Yoel Skinye. Indians catcher, Neil Lomax. Okay, we just do three spins, the first three that come up are your winners. Here we go, Mike Schmidt, congratulations. Uh, are the Phillies still hanging in there, or have they been officially eliminated? I, I hope they can pull it off, but... I have to check tonight's scores. I only know that Boston lost, and so Seattle is uh, tied for that second spot. Um, okay, you can just tell me which stack you like the best. Uh, send me an email. My email is in the comment, the video description below. Next winner. Autographs 2000. Uh, again, send me an email. You're going to have to rank these in order. One is the stack you want the most. Two is the second, the stack you want second most. Three, the least most. And finally, Diamond Princess. You will send me an email as well. Tell me which stack you want in order. And thanks for, I think we have two first time winners, which is great to see. It means the channel's growing. We love that. Mostly because it means more friends. And I thank you for being my friend and participating in the giveaway. Until next time, remember, we don't count subscribers, we count friends.